Okay, so let's check out the edit menu. Here we have the typical stuff where you can, you know, undo, redo, cut, copy, and paste, and delete. You can also format by doing things such as commenting, out, denting, completing Word, argument info, pretty much for editing the text. I recommend you guys just memorize the shortcuts and use them religiously. They will save you so much time. And then we can also do some code snippets here that will, you know, generate if then statement for next loop and so on and so forth. But you can also generate those, like I said, by learning shortcuts. So for example, if I do four, push tab, check it out, it creates a for loop for me. If I wanna do a if loop, if tab condition. Uh, what other, if I want to do a do while loop, I can do do tab, oh wow, didn't do anything, do while. Ah, uh, there you go, that's weird. Do tab doesn't do anything, but do space, creates the do loop while, okay? So just learn those shortcuts, it'll be that easy. Otherwise, you guys will have to sit there and do everything yourself like this. You'll have to do something like that. You guys can see it takes a little bit of time. In the view menu, you guys already know, here you just have options to view many to view all of the panes and menus that UFT has. You can even check out the keyword view over here. And I have errors, which you guys can see down here. So let me quickly fix them. And then I'll show you guys the keyword view. Save that, error gone. Now let's go to view, keyword view. UFT thinks it's a big hit for some reason. I don't get it. I've never seen anybody use it. It doesn't make any sense. But here you can generate different keywords, you know, like you can do systemuto.run. If you want to change the value of this, I guess you can do something else. Then if you want to add another item, you can do object from the repository, select something. Maybe like, let's select the home page. Sync, no, we want something else. You can see something else. So it allows you to create a test case by picking keywords, operations, and values. It's okay, but like I said, no one's ever used it, so don't even worry about it. Just know that it exists. Let's move on to the search menu.